Mr. DeWitt. Mr. DeWitt. Mr. DeWitt. Are you all right? I'm fine. You were dreaming. You kept saying your daughter's name, Sally. She's not my daughter. I thought... Pain and beauty. To an artist, they are parent and child. Cohen? I'm sending you to find your young one. <laughs> no need to thank me. I'm not so sure you'll like what you find. Look. Fontaine's. Brian sent the whole thing to the bottom. But it's a prison now. Why would Cohen have sent Sally there? I don't know. Everyone has needs. I merely provide a service for those who have the means to pay. You'll find your little bird in the housewares department. How many people do you suppose Ryan's got locked up in that place? Enough. Fontaine had amassed something near an army. Now they're down there, spliced up and wild. All right, there's a dock up ahead. Takes a cold son of a bitch to do that to a living person. What's that? Burial at sea. You read your residency contract with Ryan Industries? In perpetuity, we're all buried at sea. Comfortable. Just keep your eyes open. There seem to be some supplies this way, Mr. DeWitt. It's Booker. What? Just call me Booker. If it's all the same to you. Let's leave it at Mr. DeWitt. Look up there. Let's have another look around. Perhaps we'll be able to find something to get us up and over. Could be. A skyhook. Skyhook? You mean the air grabber? Kids use them to ride around up on the new mobiles. Air grabber? Huh. Constants and variables. Constants and what? Never. Goddamn grabber stuck. I want the frosty one. Get me Mr. DeWitt! Someone's coming! I got the grabber unjammed. Is that now? Let the money! Mr. DeWitt, look. Housewares. That's where Cohen said we'd find Sally. The store ran trams between the three buildings. We'll need to avail ourselves of that. Assuming it still works. Optimism, Mr. DeWitt. It helps in situations like this.
When did you come to Rapture? Oh, it was, uh, geez, I guess around 51? No, 48? That's a rather large gap. Time. Life I had before sort of becomes a blur. 49. 49 for sure. Damn. You look a mess, Mr. DeWitt. Just keep your eyes open for splicers. They can do us a whole lot worse. Here, little birdies. Eat it up. Well, it, it's good for you, you know? I've never heard of birds that didn't like seeds. What's, what's the matter? Yo, 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 get what you got coming! Let you and me talk! Ammo, Mr. DeWitt! Mr. DeWitt, catch! Great. Mr. DeWitt. Well, there's the tram. That splicer had no problem freezing a path for himself before. I'm sure he'll be happy to do the same for us. I have no doubt you'll prove persuasive. Mr. DeWitt, look. Sunk a few hundred feet beyond its specifications. More pressure, more burst pipes. Matters progress so little. I could turn this with a rake pick. Done. Where'd you learn that? Oh, it's something I picked up a long time ago. Yeah, our frozen friend leaves a hell of a trail. Come on. Just let me in, okay? <laughs> Dante, he said we're all equal down here now. We're all in the same boat.
Where'd you go last night? Ryan, you bastard. Left me here to rot. Sure, I signed the contract. Helped turn Fontaine into a prison. Ten days, big rush, everything slapped at. Right before the prisoners are brought in. One of your piece of shit turrets. Bam! Both kneecaps. Now I'm likely a cripple locked in a jail, surrounded by maniacs. I haven't even been paid, but I don't care. Just get me out of here! Needs picking. Mm. Got it. Did you give him my message? Did you give him my message? It used to be such a thrill to hear Ryan speak. Parasite, this. And the exaltation of man, that. Sure, it could all get a bit of a bore. But the old bear sure knew how to enunciate.
What are you trying to pull? Hey, don't point that at me. Schubert Theater and stinks a little more with each passing night. <laughs> the Tribune called my first Let's opera see. as having the effect of canceling out all of Mozart's classics in a single caterwaul. And now critics take me to task for my humanitarian work. If I were not there to find a home for What's the happened to these people. They don't even seem sane. Nothing beats your first spice. From there, it's all downhill. The frozen frosties, the jockeys who'll hand you a thousand volts as soon as look at you. You sound sympathetic. It would be the first sons of bitches who found an answer at the bottom of a bottle. But once you see them go all weak at the knees at the sight of a little sister and all her adder, they cut a less sympathetic figure. Short circuit. Probably be able to pop it open. A jolt of shock jockey? You familiar with shock jockey? More than you could know. Let's look around. Maybe there's a store ain't been ransacked by splicers yet.
Looks like the plasma department is back that way. I'm sure we'd find something useful there. It's done. In here. Something tells me all that cold isn't just coming from the ice rink. Mr. DeWitt, the plasmid? Have you forgotten what we came for? Fancy putting those lock picking skills to work? I'll give it a whirl. Want me to open up that cabinet? <laughs> 